Hey everybody, it's Paige, and today's video is going to be a makeup organization video. This is gonna be like one of my old school makeup organization videos. I just filmed a PR haul, if you guys haven't seen it yet, I will link it down below. And today we're gonna be cleaning up the mess that is the result of said PR haul. So um, I'm gonna show you guys the mess that we're working with. I'm going to break down all of the boxes and categorize the makeup and skincare and just do some nice, satisfying, laid back organization. So if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy. And let's go ahead and get started. So a big part of the mess is this mound of boxes here on the ground. So I have to break down all of these boxes so that they can be recycled and get them out of this room because they take up like half of the floor in here. <laughs> and then up here is where I have all of my products and like little cards and stuff like that. So um, this is where the makeup organization will begin, but I'm actually going to start by separating like the paper and bubble wrap and then breaking down all of the boxes. So I got the boxes all put away. Now we are going to focus on the top of my desk. Now if you guys saw my makeup organization video earlier this week, I just had this all clean and pristine. So it's all wiped down, it's still clean, but it just has, it's disorganized. So that's what we're gonna work on now. I'm gonna try to sort things on this table. I'll probably use some of this space, like counter space over here, but I'm going to try to separate this stuff into makeup, skincare, and then like body care, and then we will go from there. So we're gonna start off with my makeup. So I separated the products out based on brand. So I have Kaja over here, Ofra right here, which might be out of frame, Milk Makeup, Laura Mercier, Benefit, Urban Decay ColourPop, and Laura Lee. So I have my skincare, body care, and like miscellaneous items over here behind me, so I'll bring those over category by category as we kind of go through them. So starting off with the Laura Lee Liquid Lips, I will absolutely be keeping these. If you guys haven't seen my other PR haul makeup organization videos, basically I go through all of the products that I received in my previous PR haul and um, I sort through them, I organize them by category, and then I go through them with you in more detail than in my PR haul, so I'll show, show you shades. And then I set products aside for giveaways. So um, we are starting off with the Laura Lee Liquid Lips. They are absolutely beautiful. I love nude lips 
all of these look like very wearable shades for me so we have old rose which is this one right here then we have blushing and then we have spicy pink all of these look absolutely stunning so i'm going to keep those for sure next we have laura mercier so um first up we have the illuminating primer this is the illuminating canvas primer i actually already have this product so i am going to set this aside for a giveaway i'm going to check to see if i have this shade this is french riviera this is the tinted moisturizer blush so i will be right back so I actually don't have the shade, so that means I am going to be keeping it. And then we have the tinted moisturizer. This is the oil-free tinted moisturizer. I don't think I have this, so I am going to keep this. Um, but if I do end up having it, then I will pass that along for someone else to try. And I actually do already have the Secret Brightening Powder for under eyes, so since I already have one, I will also be adding this product to a giveaway. Next, we have Benefit. We have a lot of Benefit products, and if you guys saw my brow organization video, I did like a huge eye product organization video, declutter, just like overhaul of my eye product drawers, including brow products. Um, so if you saw that, you know that I have a lot of these. <laughs> so um, I think what's going to happen here is I'm going to keep their new Gimme Brow Plus Volumizing Pencil. I'm so excited to try this. Um, I also will keep their 24-hour brow setter. I love this stuff so much. It is fantastic. I will pass along the brush, which is fantastic. Um, I already have Gimme Brow, so those can go as well. I also actually have all of these products already as well, so I'm going to pass these along. So someone is going to get, oops, I just dropped the pomade. Someone is going to get a bunch of really nice brow products. And if the shades don't end up working for you, maybe you know someone in your life that you could pass them along to and share the goodies with. I'm definitely keeping the She-Hulk palette. I'm so excited for this palette. I think it's so fun, and like I said, these textures look beautiful. No further questions. The shade looks insane. Gamma Glow looks beautiful. Um, W-A-E-H-O, I don't know how you pronounce that, Warrior. This purple, insane. So, um... I'm very excited about those palettes, so that one will definitely be staying along with my ColourPop products. Some of these are new to me, like the eyeshadow palette, which let me give you guys a close-up of this eyeshadow palette. It's absolutely stunning. I'm obsessed with it. This is so pretty. I want to use this, like, tomorrow. So, um, you guys will see a full face of first impressions very soon. So, that's probably going to be featured, either that or the She-Hulk palette. But I am definitely keeping that. That's new to me, along with these two products, the Brow Pencil and the Super Shock Cheek in Lunch Money. And then I have experience with the Hyaluronic Creamy Concealer and the... Hyaluronic Acid Setting Mist, but I will absolutely be keeping those. I love the Pretty Fresh line from ColourPop. I'm going to move all of my Keep products over here so that I can stay somewhat organized. I am definitely keeping the Smitha collab with Ofra. This is so exciting. She has three products in her collaboration. Um, we have the highlighter. This is in the shade Flash. It's a beautiful golden highlight. Here is the info on the back. So these products are sold individually, the highlighter and the two liquid lipsticks, which these are the shades here. We have a really pretty nude and more of like a berry red kind of shade. And these are in the shades Bestie and Stand Out, both super pretty. But they also have a bundle where you can get minis of all three products and it's only $36. Plus you guys can use code PAGE for 20% off. So I definitely recommend checking out this new collab. I will absolutely be keeping it. I love Ofra. You can see a little peak of my Ofra lippies over here. <laughs> um, so yeah, those are definitely staying. 
Then we have milk makeup, and I'm not even gonna lie, I'm gonna keep all of this. Um, I am so excited. This was my first milk makeup package, so um, this is so cool to me. And there's a lot of really cool, fun new stuff in here that I've never tried. The only two products from here that I have tried are the Hydro Grip Primer, which I needed a new one, and the Hydro Grip Setting Spray. Everything else is new to me. Um, we have this new mattifying primer here, which is really cool. I also am really excited to try this out. This is the Sunshine Skin Tint. It's SPF 30. I have it in the shade Light. And then there's also an under eye. Um, this is the Sunshine Under Eye Tint and Brighten. Here is what that looks like. Super similar packaging. So cute. We have a mascara, a Kush Fiber Brow Gel. This is a Bionic Blush. This is a an electric, no, yes, electric glossy lip plumper. This is a little lip and cheek blush stick. And then this I'm so excited for. This is the matte bronzer stick in the shade Baked. I have seen so many people rave about this product and I can't wait to try it. And then we have the Hydro Grip Eye Primer which again, I am so excited to try this out. I didn't even know that was a product that existed. So we're just gonna slide all of this over this way. And then finally, we have Kaja, which I already have a few of these products. I have the uh, Wink Lash Trio, so that I will put in a giveaway. I will put the uh, Hydrating Lip Shine. This is the Gloss Shot in Clear, Crystal Clear. This is a great formula. My favorite shade is Milk Tea. I highly recommend it, but I already have this shade, so I will put that in a giveaway as well. And then I also have this already. This is the Wink Stamp Wing Eyeliner Pen and Stamp Long. I guess they probably have different lengths. This is the long version. Um, so it has an eyeliner, like a wing eyeliner stamp. And then it also has a liquid liner in here as well. So I'll definitely try this out sometime and let you guys know my thoughts. But like I said, I do already have this, so I can pass that along. Um, I have, oh, I also have the Love Swipe. I'm pretty sure I have the shade Sweet Softy, so I can put this in a giveaway as well. But I am going to keep the Cheeky Stamp in the shade Koi, as well as the Bento Box in the shade Peach uh, Madeline or Madeline. Um, both of these, I don't think I have these. I will double check on the shades that I have in my collection, but I'm pretty sure that I don't have these, so I will be keeping those as well. So, we already have a good little stash of makeup products for a giveaway, which is super exciting. Now we're going to move on to body care, since I only have a few body care products, and I'm going to be keeping all of them. So we have the Drunk Elephant Wonder Wild Miracle Butter. This is, I, I'll call it a uh, body care because it's kind of an everywhere salve and it treats dry, chapped, irritated, or compromised skin. Um, obviously you can use this on your face so it can be chapped lips, dry elbows, windburned cheeks, cracked heels, that type of thing. So it's kind of a skincare or body care. So I am definitely keeping that along with the Sol de Janeiro Bomb Dia Bright. This is the body wash and it has AHA and BHA in it, which is super cool that it's a chemical exfoliating body wash in the Bomb Dia scent. I love this scent from Sol de Janeiro. And then we also have the new Bomb Dia body scrub, which also has AHA and BHA in it. So this is both a physical exfoliant and a chemical exfoliant. Again, in that Bomb Dia scent, which I love so much. So all of those products will be staying. Um, as far as like non-beauty products go, we have this super cute makeup bag, which I actually think I might put the giveaway products inside of here. Um, just because I think that would be super fun and cute so I will um, put that in the giveaway portion I just have to take out the little paper that's in there and then I'm going to keep the P 
peach and honey preserves that pharmacy sent me how cute is this i am so excited to try this it looks so cute with my shirt and i love the packaging i am so obsessed with that so that's gonna stay along with this super cute bucket hat that laura mercier sent over it's kind of like a terry cloth maybe it's like a towel i think it's terry cloth is what this uh fabric is and it says flawless summer on the back i love the neutral aesthetic we have the laura mercier branding there it's just a really pretty kind of like white cream color with a light nude embroidering on it so i thought that was super cute so that will be staying as well and finally we have skincare so let me move all of my skincare products over here all right so for skincare we have pharmacy first aid beauty drunk elephant and pop beauty so i'm gonna start with the pop beauty i'm going to keep this exfoliating jelly i'm actually gonna try this tonight this is um, their Peeling Zing C Exfoliating Jelly. You put it on your skin, you let it sit for a few minutes, and then you massage it into your skin and rinse off. It sounds fantastic, and I cannot wait to try that. However, I will pass along the Fizz Jelly Cleanser and the Supreme Sea Cream Creamy Moisturizer. I just have a lot of skincare, and I know that someone could get some really good use out of those products. Next, we have First Aid Beauty. I actually already have some of these facial radiance pads, so I'm going to add those to the giveaway. How It hurts me because I want to keep them because they're so good, but I know I need to let them go. And then we have the 10% Vitamin C Brightening Serum along with the Facial Radiance Niacinamide Dark Spot Serum. And I love First Aid Beauty's products. I will definitely be keeping those to try those out. I have been dealing with some dark spots recently, which is not fun. I've just been having a lot more active acne, which turns into hyperpigmentation and so on. So that's gonna be great for that. Drunk Elephant, I will be keeping both of these. We have the Behydra Intensive Hydration Serum. This is great if you're looking for a hydrating serum for oily skin. It's like a gel-based serum, so it's not overly oily or heavy for oily skin which i love and then this is the umbra tint physical daily defense sunscreen it's a slightly tinted sunscreen if you're looking for a good spf that has spf 30 that doesn't leave a white cast i highly recommend this one it is fantastic and then finally we have pharmacy and i'm not even gonna lie all of this is staying i'm so overly excited about the peaches and cream makeup melt away cleansing balm that is going to be fantastic we have the Green Clean Makeup Melts Weight Cleansing Balm. This is a mini. I actually will put this in the giveaway because I do have one of these already. So I will go back on what I said and I will add that to the giveaway. And then we have the Deep Sweep Pore Cleaning Toner, which I actually just finished one of these up. So this came at the perfect time. I will be keeping that along with the Whipped Greens Oil-Free Foaming Cleanser and the Daily Greens Oil-Free Gel Moisturizer. This is newly reformulated, and I can't wait to try it. I loved the original, but I've heard this is new and improved, and I have really, really high expectations for it. So while I was emptying the paper out of this bag, I realized there was another product in here. This is the Extra zing c shot vitamin c serum so i'll go ahead and add this to my giveaway pile so what i'm gonna do is there's gonna be a giveaway in today's video <laughs> i'm going to fill this bag up with products we'll see what i can fit from here whatever's left over i will save for future giveaways that's typically kind of how i do this so um yes yeah, since we have the pop beauty bag i'm gonna go ahead and add the pop beauty products in here so we have the fizz jelly cleanser and the supreme sea cream along with the extra zing sea shot so these products will be going in to the bag Next, we will go for some Laura Mercier. So we have the Pure Canvas. This is the Illuminating Primer. Let me zoom you guys in. 
a little bit more just so you can kind of see the products better. So this I will be adding into the bag. I'll also go ahead and throw in the Secret Brightening Powder. This is for under eyes. This is a full size powder. Really, really nice. I would definitely recommend that if you're looking for an under eye powder. I want to add some of these benefit products in there. So like I said, if these shades don't end up working for you and you win this giveaway, um, just do your best to pass them along or donate them or do whatever you want with them. Um, I'll add the Gimme Brow in the shades two and three into the giveaway. I'll also go ahead and add the pomade and this is the angled brow brush and spoolie. All right, let's see. We can definitely fit a few more products in here. I want to add some of these Kaja products. So maybe we'll do the Wink Lash Trio. This is like a trio of products that are all magnetized together. There's a mascara, lash primer, and brow serum in here. We also have this gloss shot. This is the clear gloss shot. It's in crystal clear. I'll add that. And then I think we can fit this Love Swipe lightweight cushiony lip mousse in here as well. I think, let's see, maybe we can fit these brow products in there. Um, the bag is pretty full as it is, but let's see if we can squeeze these in here. So we have the micro brow filling pen that definitely fits and let's see if we can get the precisely my brow pencil yes it fits okay so we got pretty much everything in here aside from these three products so these three products i will save for future giveaways but for this giveaway, I will have the rules on how to enter down below in the description box, but you just need to subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Instagram, and then leave a comment down below. It can be any comment at all. Just make sure you put your Instagram username in the comments down below. Don't put the at sign because sometimes that will flag comments as like spam. So just put your username without the at sign in the comment, in whatever comment you want. It can be anything. Um, and then also I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a warning because there have been a lot of scammers out there recently I will contact you from my personal Instagram account make sure you are getting the message from me I will never ask for credit card information or ask you to click any links or anything I will message you to let you know that you won and then um, ask for your name and shipping address. So don't give anyone credit card information. Don't click on any links. I don't use WhatsApp or WhatsApp or however you say it. <laughs> um, so if you get a reply or a comment on this video that looks like it might be me and it's you know telling you to click a link, it's not me. So just wanted to make that as clear as possible. Um, don't fall for the scams because they they're getting good um, So anyway, if you guys would like to enter like I said all the rules will be in the description box So you can make sure you did everything and that's gonna be it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up I love you all so so much. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye